Hi. I'm Kylie. Hi, Kylie. Nice, nice to meet you. you. Nice to meet you, too. Okay, can you tell me a little bit about your character in the show? Sure. I play R Belinda Romero, and um, Belinda is Samuel Bruckner's personal assistant. He's the big billionaire tycoon um, who is played by Dennis Quaid. And Belinda is a, is a real tough character. She kind of has to be working for someone like Bruckner, and she um, she's learning the ropes in, in the art world, in the auction world, and she wants to sort of make her way doing her own thing. Um, she's a real go-getter. She'll stop at nothing. What was it like working with Dennis Quaid? It was so much fun. I mean, at, at first I was I was a little like apprehensive, a little intimidated because he's you know I grew up watching Dennis Quaid and he's such yeah. a huge yeah. icon. Yeah, the um, dad from Parent Trap. What exactly. more do you need to know? Exactly, exactly. Uh, but honestly, like he's so funny. Oh my God, we were on the bus. Um, there was a scene where we had to shoot. I can't say too much, but there's there were a lot of kids on the bus, and we were in shooting in Montreal, so they were all French kids. And uh, I'm from Montreal, so I speak French. But he was trying to tell them like, okay, when we get there, you have to get off the bus. None of them understood him, and they were like blah 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 blah. Like they were just like these little kids that don't know who he is. And then he was like thought it was hilarious. So we're just sitting there talking, and he gets up and he's like, do you know who I am? I'm the dad from Parent Trap. <laughs> I'm so glad he clings to that like I do. No, but it was such a joke, but he's a jokester. You know, he doesn't like take himself too seriously. And he was just like really fun to work with. And and uh, he was great. Like, I, he was fantastic. Yeah. That's so nice to yeah. hear. <laughs> now, when you Netflix and chill, or tonight we might say when you crackle and chill, yeah. what is your go-to to watch? Um, right now, I am watching um, Mr. Robot. Actually, is that what you're? Is that what you're asking me? What show I'm watching? Yeah, anything. Yeah. What do you? Um, I bought that on iTunes because okay. it's not on any um, streaming service in Canada. I don't know how it is in the states. You I don't think a, it's here. You guys have a lot more, by the way, option-wise, on terms of like really? in ne on Netflix. And I'm not sure how Crackle's going to be, but the platforms are different in different wow. countries. And Canada's like doesn't have as much. So what I a buy, bummer! Buy, Welcome I to America. Of, yeah, seriously. <laughs> <laughs> I buy a lot of stuff on iTunes. You know, I just yeah. buy it. I'm like, yeah. I'll watch it. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So if you were to ever run a heist, hypothetically, whoa, okay, what would it be for? What would you take? I would like to take cars. I love cars. Oh, yeah. I love Grand cars. Theft Auto. I love, yeah, Grand Theft Auto, totally. <laughs> fast cars, just like something really cool, black on black, like fast stick shift. Like, I love that. Yeah, yeah. So we'll see you in Fast and Furious 20. Is yeah, that the next sure. one? That's I'm, 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 I'm writing it, actually. Perfect. Yeah, it's Perfect. great. Yeah, it's coming. I look forward to seeing yeah. you in that when Vin Diesel's like 80 years old. Yeah, he'll still probably look the same yeah. and just as jacked. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you so much for talking to me. Have fun tonight. Thank you. <laughs>